Hi, I'm Dylan, and today I'm going to show you the Cami Keyboard Production Station. For years, musicians have struggled to keep production as fluid as rehearsal. Notes get changed, chords, timbres, form, all on the fly. And in session, it's kind of hard to keep all those things straight. But with the Cami, it's easy. One way it's easy is the way we programmed these eye displays. For me, as a personal preference, I like to keep my hottest commands. Play, record, quantize, save, export, all my tracks, my clip splitting, duplicate, combine even my CPU meter. All of it a one-touch affair. Let's start with the drums. Alright. As always, select and quantize. Perfect. Now for the kick. Now for the next layer. this in the pocket. Command save, then we can move on. Next part for me will be keys. Trim, consolidate, select, and quantize. Now that we have the keys out of the way, next up is sound design. And for me, I like my sound design to be expressive, whether it be a harmonic or rhythmic thing. And what better way to get both than using the X ribbon as an arpeggiator? As you can see, I have a very reactive strip to use when using gate time. Let's try it. For those of you wondering, all the automation I just did live was recorded and saved, allowing me to duplicate as I need.
With the cami, it's extremely easy to make a full verse. The four bars I just spent doing, I can duplicate easily with one touch and make a full phrase. Now that I've made my chords, I have four bars that I want to use. I need to go through, highlight everything, and then to simply duplicate. And I have a full phrase. Now that I have my phrase the way I want it, I can start to solo over it. I've assigned the XY pad to control a few things, my reverb along with my delay. Once again, I'm Dylan, and thank you for watching this tutorial on how to make music with the cami. If you have any more questions, please contact us at www.musiccomputing.com.